Hey everyone, today I'm diving deep into the heated debate around U.S. immigration, sparked recently by a border visit from Senator J.D. Vance. Vance took aim at Vice President Kamala Harris, criticizing her administration's handling of immigration issues, particularly at the border. Vance's comments come at a time when immigration is a hot-button issue, with both sides of the political spectrum fiercely debating the best approach. Harris, who has been in the spotlight for her role in addressing border security, responded by highlighting her efforts to strengthen measures and support local communities. Speaking of local communities, Harris has recently garnered endorsements from several mayors of Arizona border towns. These endorsements are crucial, especially with Arizona being a swing state. Local leaders believe Harris's policies are beneficial for their towns, which could sway voters in this key region. But it's not just political endorsements making headlines. The Biden administration has suspended immigration permits for citizens of Cuba, Haiti, Nicaragua, and Venezuela. This temporary halt is due to concerns about potential fraud involving financial sponsors. The Department of Homeland Security is currently reviewing these allegations, including cases where deceased individuals' social security numbers were used. This policy change has sparked a heated debate. Critics argue the program should never have been implemented, while supporters point out its effectiveness in reducing illegal border crossings. Amidst these political debates, it's important to acknowledge the scale of undocumented immigration. Since 2020, an estimated 2 million undocumented immigrants have crossed the U.S. border, highlighting the ongoing challenges faced by border security. Let's break that down. These numbers reflect the complexities of the immigration debate, showing the significant impact on border security and immigration policies showing how undocumented immigrants play a vital role in the U.S. economy. As discussions about immigration reform continue, these contributions provide valuable data for policymakers and the public. While the debate remains multifaceted, the economic impact of undocumented immigrants is undeniable. So, what do you think about the current state of U.S. immigration? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more updates. Until next time, stay informed and stay engaged. Thanks for watching.